this is Mari Lane from the Bangs Face Channel. I'm sorry I didn't mean to leave you with a cliffhanger. Um, this is the uh, pearl necklace. I'm going through the lot uh, from a charity auction that happened on Carol's Creative Corner. And uh, I bought this lot from Dawn. And uh, this is, uh, I donated um, over $100. Um, it was the first sale for Dawn's channel, over $100. And I've got all this lovely jewelry. And I was getting ready in part one to open up this clasp. And I was asking everybody to hold their breath and pray because I'd never open a clasp like this when um, the video ended. So, uh... I did not mean to do that at all. And now I'm struggling to find the release again. Let me look at this a little closer. Oh, it is on this side. Okay. Okay, you can see the little tab on the outside of the clasp where the rhinestones are. So there it is. Absolutely did not do that on purpose. But uh, I looked at the end of that video and I thought I had pulled them apart before uh, the video ended and it ended up not so there it is it's clasp <laughs> a little excitement in my jewelry video okay this piece is name brand and it's gold tone And they're these beautiful little hearts. That extend down. And look at the price tag. The original price tag on this one piece. So, uh, this lot was well worth $100. If I'd have gone out and bought this uh, on uh, eBay or Amazon, or if I'd have bought it in a, from a, a department store, I definitely would have paid way more than I paid. So, I get the equivalent in jewelry as the money I've spent, if not more, and um, I get to help with good calls. I love charity auctions. Now this is one of the pieces. I had said earlier that this piece did not show, was not shown at the auction, but absolutely positively was. So I'm getting in now to some of the items that were, <coughs> excuse me, not shown. And uh, this is a set of earrings. Very nice danglies, little stones. A lot of the ladies in the jewelry community have done what Dawn has done here and place, uh, make their own little earring cards. So the earrings will stay together, of course. Dawn puts everything in all these little separate bags so you don't have to worry about um, anything being tangled. Oh, this was a shown item. It's a beautiful bracelet. I don't know 
Yeah, this one's not going to fit me, but it is nice new, and it has wire mesh in it, so it's of a newer design. A lot of this is vintage jewelry, like the pearls. I love vintage pearls. And look at this. Oh my goodness. This uh, reminded Dawn of the gold lame era in the 90s, 80s and 90s. I just love this. I wore, um, I had, um, in the early 90s, I worked at AT&T. And um, even though we were just on the telephone, they want us, wanted us to sparkle. That's what my supervisor told me. You need to sparkle. So anyway, <laughs> I went out and got this very, very liquid gold lame, uh, gold blouse and silver blouse. And um, and uh, I would I started putting um, sparkle in my um, eye collar. <laughs> Now, this one was shown. This is a very long, over-the-head necklace. You know, you're in a hurry. You just put it over the head. Matter of fact, I'm just going to put this over my head right now when you go on out the door. So, anyway, this is official Disney merchandise. There's, uh, I don't know if you can see the mouse ears. But very nice, delicate or very detailed work there with some um, danglies hanging up here and that like that particular stone that's not round but sided has some bling to it and this is as you can see still has the price on it 1995 and you can see that it's official Disney merchandise And it says Disney there. Now this says it was made in China, which a lot of things <clears throat> Disney has. It's made in China. Oh, this is an item that was not shown. <clears throat> Please forgive my voice. It's like two to three in the morning. I'm going through jewelry. Wow. There's two in here. Nice gold chain. This is a pleasant surprise. Oh, there's two of them. Nice. I could wear them together. And they're the same length. They're not attached. You, these could be worn or sold separately. Or um, maybe I could give... I could wear one and Marty wear the other. Have a matching jewelry. I never thought about doing that. Anyway, there's been times that we are in um, not showing each other, of not seeing what we're uh, the other one's going to wear. Like the other day, I wore purple culottes. <laughs> it's Florida, you know. And this one, oh my goodness. That's cold. <gasps> this is beautiful. It has a little bit of an extender on it. But anyway, she wore black pants and a purple shirt, and uh, I wore uh, purple culottes and a darker shade of purple, and uh, the, my blouse and her shirt matched as far as the shade of purple. Uh, this little bracelet that's wooden is a bonus that I did not see. Actually, it's kind of funny. I came in the room about when right before that cross started to be shown so 
so I had to go back and watch the video <laughs> to see. Oh my goodness, this is Golden May Choker too. This is one of those things I you could wear probably as an anklet. It's too big for a bracelet, but it's definitely well. It's got a very long extender. You wear it as anklet or. Um, a choker but there's a, a long extender on there and this pair of clip-on earrings that are faux pearl were not shown so this is a bonus I was not expecting. She had said, you know, at this point in time, oh, there's 10 items in here, you know, to let everybody know kind of how many additional items there was in the lot, but she didn't show everything. Beautiful classic floral pattern in faux pearl. Here's the pair. 